Salutations, all YouTube goers. I am going to show you a few things here. I'm going to show you probably one of the best or the best ROM sites you could possibly go to and one of the safest. And I will show you how to be downloading Super, Ten Super Nintendo ROMs from this website and how to use them with both SNES 9X and ZSNES. So, to start off with, let me show you this site. It is called theoldcomputer.com. I'll put a link in the description. Um, this is probably one of the best websites out there to get ROMs, pretty much any ROMs. Um, as you can see in this little thing right here, you probably can't see it too well, but uh, it has all the Atari types of systems in there, pretty much all the systems besides PlayStation. Um, so they do have all the ROMs, they just don't have any ISOs of PlayStation games, and those are what you use for a PlayStation emulator. So right now, I am conveniently in the Super Nintendo section, and this website is not hard to navigate. There's a ROM thing right here where you can pick all of them or this conveniently placed bar right here which has all the systems and it's very well alphabetized so I will just go and pick some random sort of ROM uh, let's do this I don't, I don't even know what it is um, what you're going to want to do is save it to whatever is the most accessible for me. It's the desktop. Go ahead and do that. And never once have I ever gotten a virus ever from the site or spyware. Uh, well, occasionally I get spyware, but spyware comes on with any site, even YouTube. And it takes a bit to download. If you have a good connection, it may take even less time. But I have Comcast, so well, that's, that's not bad. And it scans for the viruses. I recommend you do this on Mozilla, which most of you do because it's probably the safest internet browser. Okay. Now, close that out. Uh, it's right here, as you can see. Um, you can either use 7-zip to unzip this, or you can do... WinRAR, which I personally like a lot better than 7-Zip, the range of what it can unzip is a lot bigger than 7-Zip, so what you're going to want to do is extract files, not extract files here because then your files will be all over your desktop. Extracting the files will go to directly, it will make a folder and go directly there. Just click OK. There you go, as quick as that. Um, first I'm going to show you how to get this ROM to work on ZSNES, uh, all you gotta do, very simple, double click, and that's it. Double click. I may do another tutorial on how to actually necessarily work this game, or this, I mean, this emulator, but that'll have to be for another tutorial. Um, and then the next one, the next emulator I'm going to show you is called SNES 9X, I believe. Yeah, SNES, SNES 9X. And I, my gameplay varies between these two systems, or these two emulators, I believe, I'm sorry. Uh, really easy to get this to work is... You just have to look for it. It's not as simplistic as ZSNS, but it works just fine. As you can see, it's in the desktop here. Right here. And it shows you what's all in that folder. Double click. There you go. Now, the reason why I vary between these two because, well, SNS 9X is easier to record video from, but ZSNES is easier to set um, save state uh, keys. Like I set 
my save state to one of the buttons on my controller and it's easier so I can like just like that uh, get that to that save state but yeah I will put a link in the description for this website and uh, maybe I'll show do another video on how to get those other two emulators but if you ever need me to look up a ROM for you, I can do that. Just message me or put in the comment section. Um, or if you, and if you want another tutorial, just let me know and I'll do it. Uh, this has been Demon, Sp Demon Spoke. Sorry. Don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe. And I'll just catch you guys later.